sorry for the excitement. Uh, if you're watching this, it means you've somehow managed to stumble stupidly onto my channel. But anyway, it doesn't matter. Welcome. Anyway, I hope you like the videos. Um, today's video is actually going to be um, just as the title says. If you can see the titles, how you know you're in South Africa. Okay, like that's just what the video is going to be about. And before I get into the video, I just want to show you guys a quick thing that South Africans do. I've got right here South African chappies. Right, this is South African gum. It's like proudly South African gum chappies. And then I've got some Wrigley's extra. Uh, but if you're in South Africa, Wrigley's extra is ultimately going to end up being chappies. Okay, because every South African gum is just chappies. Don't matter what gum it is, don't matter what brand it is, we don't care if you're going to chew it, it's gum, it's chappies. Anyway, without further ado, here's the video. I hope you guys like it. Enjoy. Uh, yes. Okay, today I'm doing a video of when you know you're in South Africa. Okay, so you know you're in South Africa when the taxis, the combis are driving practically everywhere, including the flipping pavements where people are supposed to walk, but the taxi will be walk driving on there. Okay, and the second thing is you know you're in South Africa when everybody says robots instead of traffic lights. Because if you're in a taxi and you say after a robot, you can get off. If you say after the traffic light, the driver's woman looking at you like, what the F? Like, what you talking about? And you know in South Africa when people say, come friend, jump the street. Or, oh, when you get to that traffic, to that robot, jump the street, like you can literally hop over and jump. Instead of cross the street, we say jump the street. Like, really, really, come think of it, it don't make no sense. It don't make no damn sense, South Africans. Anyway, the next thing is, you know you're in South Africa and everybody says braai instead of barbecue. But we love our braai. We love our braai. And we have our specific braai course. Okay, which nobody can change, by the way. We love our brats. And you know you in South Africa when they offer you pop and bright. No salads, pop and chakalaka. You know you in South Africa. And you also know you in South Africa when they say B.O.B. Oh, I'm having a bright, but it's a B.O.B. then. Oh, okay. A B.O.B. of what? Oh, you bring your own everything. You bring your own chair, you bring your own meat, you bring your own booze, you bring your own ice. Like, only thing I'm gonna offer is the flipping environment, the flipping place, and music. The rest, you bring yourself. That's how we will bring the OB, bring your own booze. It's supposed to be bring your own booze, but now they should call it BOE. Like, bring your own everything. That's what we do. And you know you're in South Africa when everybody gets excited, super excited, over a boy kick was. Like, it doesn't matter what race you are, everybody gets super excited over a boy kick was. I know, I love my boy kick. What do you think I got white friends for? They make good boy kick for their parents. But anyway, you know in South Africa when you see people practically begging everywhere. Like you stop at this traffic light, there's someone begging. You stop at this one, there's someone dancing for money. You stop at this one, there's someone kneeling on the traffic light begging. Like, hey, bro, you know, like every, almost every corner, there is someone begging in South Africa. And you know you're in South Africa when you're passing flipping e-tolls everywhere. Like you pay to drive your car. You pay for the damn car. You pay for the damn petrol. You are flipping servicing that car. And you still gotta pay to drive from the world. Like, what the fuck? Like, what the F? Like, seriously? Seriously, ANC? Ito's gotta go. Okay. And you know you in South Africa. Like, this is, this is like, this is like classic. You know you in South Africa. When the traffic officers stop you, and then they freely mention, cold drink. Or make a plan. Like, translation? Nigga, bribe me. I don't get paid so much or I'm bored at stopping you with your cars. Even though you got your papers, bribe me. Like, what? Huh? I don't get that. License, check. Registration, check. Everything's like on point. And I still gotta buy your ass cold drink? Like, what the? D 
Didn't you wake up to come to your job? But anyway, this is like how they are. They want to be bribed to do their jobs, like literally. And they're not even scared about it. Like cold drinks, it's like you see a traffic officer, you see cold drink. Or you hear cold drink, because that's what they're going to say. Anyway, you know you're in South Africa. When blacks and whites come together on the against the president. Jacob Zuma, but dude, I love that nigga. He's like jokes, he's so jokes with his head. And he's like, and he's like laughing his head off. Like nothing is wrong. Like everyone's like screaming, pay back the money. I'm like what money? How much? And like, pay back the money. But we all know he ain't gonna pay shit. He's probably gonna take our money and then pay us back and steal all the fuck out of us. Like, that's how it's gonna happen. He ain't gonna pay the money with his own money. Like, we just need to get that. He's not gonna do that. He's gonna take our money and he's gonna pay us with our own money. Like, we're still paying taxes. We're still paying for his children and his children's children and his other children that we don't know about and his wife. And he's probably still gonna get another one. Like, still. Because, I mean, yeah, the right girls. He girls from the right. I can't believe I just said that. Anyway, this is it for today, guys. I hope you liked the video. I um, hope you enjoyed it. But this is like, yeah, this is how you know you're in South Africa. Okay, peace out.